Well, today our first guest is the mega entrepreneur behind the Hungry Girl Empire, and she's joining us to make her delicious honey barbecue chicken and broccoli. Oh my goodness. Please welcome the awesome Lisa Lillian. Welcome, Lisa. Hi, thanks for having me. Good to see you. Great to see you. This is genius. Everything you do is fantastic. You're so good. You're, you really are great at streamlining everything in the kitchen, right? So what is it about this recipe that we're having today that you're so crazy about? Well, it, first of all, it's delicious. Okay. It's healthy. Good. It's fast. It's easy. Like okay. every recipe in the entire book. Like so checks fast. all the check, boxes check, off. Check, check, yeah, check. no yes. kidding. That's amazing. Okay. Crowd pleaser. So like I said, chicken, broccoli, barbecue sauce, we're starting with this yummy sauce. Yes, the sauce is amazing. So you start with some barbecue sauce, and then it is so simple. I can't even explain to you the simplicity of this recipe. We're adding a little bit of honey. Okay, some I like that. Thick, gooey honey to add with the sweetness, which Absolutely. works so well with the barbecue. Good. And a little bit of onion and garlic powder, and of course some salt and pepper, and that's your sauce. That's it. Are you eating already? Yeah, I'm that's okay. Eat. I mean, it's sitting right here in front of me. I don't want to get cold. Of course. Well, that's the sauce. How it tastes delicious. Tastes good. Yep, it's great, and I love that. Um, barbecue sauce sometimes has a little too much sweetness for me, and I was worried about the honey coming in, making it too sweet. But it's really nice. No, You're right. It comes together really nice. And I look for barbecue sauce with about 45 calories per serving, okay. which is usually reduced sugar. Yeah, reduced sugar. There you go. Okay. That's a great idea. Great so idea. Now, Save calories. You've got broccoli. You've got chicken. Just chicken breast in there? Chicken breast not, and cut into strips. Okay. A few cups of broccoli florets, some, some chopped onion. You can make sliced onion, whatever, however you want, any kind of onion. You toss it together. Okay, you're just mixing it all just together. Just mix it all together. It couldn't be easier. I love this recipe because it uses one tray. It's a sheet pan meal. I there are like so many. We should have given you a bigger bowl to mix that in there. Oh, it's okay. You got that? <laughs> I got yeah. it. So I have it under control. So you're literally putting that in. Once you mix yes. it together there, you're just going to lay it out on a sheet pan. That's it. Lay and it right into the on. oven. That's it. It couldn't oh be easier, goodness. couldn't be faster. There's and no right or wrong. Can Just I ask throw you it this? on there. Yes, the chicken anything. and the broccoli will cook at the same time. Like in other words, it works well for both chicken and broccoli in the oven, same time, same time? It does for this recipe. Isn't that yeah. amazing? That's great. It's that 20 minutes really well. at 375. Just flip halfway and voila. You you promised you promised quick and easy, like your book, fast and easy. You got a new book. Uh, which is great. I know we want to do the big reveal here, so I'll, I'll wait till you uh, come out of there. There it is. There it is. Look at it. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's delicious too. I'm enjoying it right here. And just like you said, boom, ready to go. Let's talk about the book, Fast and Easy. It features uh, not only this recipe, but lots of great easy recipes uh, that are absolutely delicious. Take us through some of your favorites. Sure, so this is my 14th book, so I've been at it a while. Yes. And I wanted to be creative, and so some of the things in the book that I absolutely love, I have these cucumber or pickle subs, which is just brilliant, so instead of eating a lot of carby bread, you just mm. put your sandwiches on pickles like that. I love that. Beautiful, and then there are some cake mugs that like, cook in the microwave in like three minutes. They're all totally calorie friendly, amazingly delicious. And then a lot of power bowls. I am big into power bowls. 10 minutes, 15 minutes, power bowls, lots of protein, lots of veg. Tell me about a power bowl. So when you say power bowl, you mean? You can, I like to use things like cauliflower rice okay. or you know, sometimes it's like a salad that you build on it, but there's always a protein. I use a lot of pre-cooked proteins, a lot of chicken, a lot of shrimp and then a lot of vegetables. And the, and the good thing about these too is you can make like a big sheet pan of this and then you could kind of keep it in the fridge, you could take it to work for lunch. I mean, this is really kind of user friendly too, isn't it? One million percent, family friendly, easy. Kids can help you make it, it's fun. It feels fancy and it takes no time. That's what I love. I think every recipe in this book, you feel like it's like something, like a special occasion meal and it's like, Cooks up in a snap. I called you a genius. So now you <laughs> uh, you just garnish and then you dig in. And this that's it. You. Dig so in. Please enjoy. Absolutely, guys, you're gonna love this. This is delicious and, like Lisa said, super easy. Full recipe. Head over to HallmarkChannel.com. It will be there. Lisa, thank you so much. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. For mm. more from Lisa, be sure to check out Hungry-Girl.com.